30,000 Maverick Pandemic masks gone in three hours. First off, thank you guys. It seems like you guys are really digging the new designs. And second off, it's cool that we actually provided something good. Like these will help you and give you that extra layer of protection that you might need. There's a lot of people working really hard to restock these, so we do have more. And we're saving some for the first responders here in LA, nurses, doctors, police officers, firefighters, etc. So keep checking the site. It's Maverick Clay, nurses, doctors, police officers, firefighters, etc. So keep checking the site. It's Maverick Clothing. I'll also update you guys when we do restock. It's all good stuff and it's about to get even better. It's not clickbait. I'm getting a new bird. You guys know about the tragedy that was Maverick the Parrot. How my fucking evil, evil Tibetan Mastiff Ginger the Giant ate him. And now his legacy is preserved in cloth. It's actually kind of sad. I am a bird guy. Like, I'm gonna admit it, I'm a dork. Bird guy is equivalent to cat lady. Like, it's fucking weird. I'm not proud of it. I don't know why, I just like birds. So for the past two months, I've been looking for this breed of bird I think is the coolest fucking bird ever. It's called the African Grey. They're so smart. They have the intellect of like a five-year-old. And they can say up to a thousand words. And I couldn't find one, so finally I took to social media. You guys may have seen on my Instagram, I was asking, like, does anyone know someone with an African Grey? One of my friends reached out, pointed me in the direction of this family who had an African Grey, and it needed a home, so I figured who better to adopt him than the 0-1 YouTubing boxer. He's about to be here. I'm really nervous, but also excited, so. Let's do this. This is a big moment. Oh, I'm, I'm such a dork. Let's go. <laughs> what up, bro? What up, bro? How you doing? Hey, Corona kicks, bro. <laughs> How you doing? Oh my god. Bruh! Oh my god. He's so beautiful. Hi, buddy. Hi, what's up? I'm Logan. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> oh my god, I'm already doing the thing. <laughs> Oh my god, bruh. There's gonna be a moment where he says his first word. Yeah. <laughs> oh! I love the f***ing bird. <laughs> I love him so much. Wait, this, this is how you feed him? Oh, he loves formula. Oh. This is so weird and oddly kind of uncomfortable, but I, I guess if this is how you do it, that's how you do it. Bro, he's like deep throating this syringe. This is actually kind of horrifying. It's like a fucking Lana Road scene, am I right? I'm just kidding. Come on, guys, it's a joke. So that's it. The new member of the family. Holy sh. My heart is melting right now. Good boy. Yeah, so general uh, rule of thumb, if you see this dog, who is also that dog, just stay away from her. She's got this weird thing where she like eats um, parrots. No, no, stay away from her. Bro, to think that if things go right and he stays away from that fucking dog, we'll be boys for 50 years. 50 years? That's half of Mike's age. So I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. You better start getting used to me and my pale thighs. Oh! You pooped on me! Just like everything else in my life, my bird is shitting on me! You know how much I hate birds, Yeah, bro. but this one's different. You know, what, you know how much I hate birds, Yeah, bro. but look at him. Hey, welcome to the family. Welcome to the family. He seems sweet. He's, He's so, so sweet, bro. Whoa. He's crazy, right? Bro, this bird's dope! Yes! Approval! Bro, and it has a bright feathers? I'm like actually getting goosebumps like when your dad approves your girlfriend. Yeah. Like, <laughs> so we put his cage in this corner and we actually kind of like the location of it. So I think we're gonna try to find a custom cage builder to do like a curved one right here. That way he'll be around people, he'll be social, and everyone can see him from the kitchen. Including Broly. <laughs> What? I'm right here. Oh, someone's jealous. He's never given me this much attention. Oh, Why are you so jealous? Bro, this bird can eat his own ass. I've been trying to do that for years. That's cool. As you can see, this bird is extremely uncoordinated. He looks like me attempting to run in the Challenger games. I have never seen an animal this uncoordinated, but it's because he's still a baby. Oh, we're going to work on it. We have a lot of life training to do. It's our first morning together. Are you kidding me? Is he perfect or am I tripping? Dude, we're having pillow talk and everything. I'm gonna be honest, he's a better cuddler than most of the girls I fuck with. <laughs> this dude is about to be my fucking homie for life. Let's see those wings. Let's see what you got. Yeah, the boy. <laughs> He's been kind of jumping around on the bed, testing his wings a little bit. I think if he keeps on doing this, eventually he'll be able to learn how to fly. Look. <laughs> Somehow, 
this bird has become what I like to call the instant homie. It's funny because with Maverick, you know, when I talk to him, we'd put subtitles. But since this bird will legitimately be able to speak English, I don't think we'll need subtitles. Here's what I'm teaching him to say. Motherfucker. <laughs> I love you. What's poppin'? Does it look like I'm flying? Am I about to take off? <laughs> so they told me his wings were clipped. I think it's like half true. Cause he's been flying around the house. He's ran into the fridge a couple times. I think because he's a baby, he's been sleeping a lot. And it's kind of funny, I don't know if you know this about birds or not, but when they sleep, they tuck one leg up and somehow balance on the other. But they also uh, put their head like on their back. So if you look from the front, they look like they've been decapitated. But don't worry, he still has a head, I think. No! 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 Oh, shit! Oh my god! He almost just went in the fish tank. Holy shit! Look at the fish, bro. They're animals, they're like a lion pack. Just waiting to eat the nearest parrot. Pear it. <laughs> and now our turtle's stuck? Jesus Christ. He's upside down. This, we're, we're dysfunctional. He's stuck, dude. You're right to look at him. This okay, is the dumbest shit ever. Now, after spending a few days with my new son, it was time to give him a name. A name that would make a statement. A name worthy of carrying on the legacy of Maverick the Parrot. A name so epic that it causes tremors in the earth every time it's uttered. And I finally got it. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Sir. That's right, his name is Sir, the African Grey. Y'all can hit him up on Instagram, at Sir the Grey. Or don't, I don't really care. This vlog's over. Subscribe, bye! There's gonna be a moment where he says his first word. Yeah. He's gonna be like, motherfucker. <laughs>